The Nigerian federal government has outlined an ambitious plan to overrule the country's power cycle, aiming to provide citizens at least 20 hours of electricity daily by 2027. This bold target was unveiled by the special advisor to the president of energy, Olu Vengen, during Energy Week in Cape Town, South Africa. Vengen addressed the ongoing challenges facing the sector, including aging infrastructure, inadequate maintenance, and the lack of investment that has led to frequent power grid collapses, assuring Nigerians that the Tinobu's administration is focused on extending reliable electricity to 26 million underserved citizens and improving revenue collection. In addition, the government plans to deploy 7 million smart meters across the country to ensure better energy management. Vengen also emphasized that the recent economic reforms, such as the removal of the petrol subsidy and the liberalization of the foreign exchange market, will help attract investment and revitalize the struggling oil and gas sector. As Nigerians eagerly await improvements in the power sector, Voice of the People TV is eating the streets of Lagos to gather public opinion on this significant development. Not be falling over and over again can be fixed with money. So where is the money going to in the country? And why can't they fix it now? now I don't think by 20, 2027 they will fulfill their promise of giving us 20 hours light. Now till 2027, that's three years. Um, if they can't get the light issue now, I don't think they can ever get it. Because national grid has fallen not once, twice. It's always falling. I don't think it's going to be stabilized in the next two or three years. If we can't get it now, this 2020, this 2024, I think we should not forget about it. But it depends on the president. Because us citizens normally, we require the power supply. We require the power supply for some, for some time because of our daily, daily, to daily life activities. But I think that is possible. Oh, we are not even using 20 hours. They are not even giving us... The, the grid is falling and collapsing. So if they give us 20 hours, we will not even have any grid at all. As the government sets its sights on improved power supply and economic reforms, citizens remain hopeful for positive change in the power sector. Matthew Ukunswada, reporting for Voice of the People TV.